Okay guys, what is going on? Welcome to my Monday morning. Okay, so it's Monday morning. Start of a new week, start of my bulk. Currently weighing in at 76 kilograms. Look at my face, I did a Ben 10 party yesterday. And I had to shave, so I'm like a 12 year old boy. <laughs> I don't know if I pulled it off, but I do look a lot younger. Anyway, we're currently weighing in at 76 kilograms. The plan is three months and put on lean mass. I'd like to get to 80 kilograms lean. That's four kilograms in muscle. I don't know if that's possible. I don't know what is possible with regards to putting on lean mass. I know I'm not going to be able to put on like some mass without some fat. I'll try and do uh, like a I'll show you the scales later at the gym anyway, but when I get back tonight I'll do a little measurement and we'll measure everything and I'll show you, okay? But anyway, starting off this week, what changes have I made to my diet? So, pre-workout, I never eat pre-workout, I've got some of this malt loaf with a bit of butter on. This is a toasty loaf, saurine, so it's pretty good for carbs with low fats, although I have smothered it in butter. Then, I've got some chicken and rice and broccoli. So I flavoured that chicken with my very own chipotle seasoning. And then, second lunch, I've got some sweet potatoes, some chicken and some broccoli. All right, so that's what I'm gonna be eating at work. I also got post-workout shake in here. And some protein that I'm gonna mix with some yogurt when I get to work for in between all of this okay so that's basically it so far um, and I'll see you in the next clip oh look check it out I fed the pigeons with all my own bread they love a bit of bread the pigeons I like to feel like I'm doing my bit for the, the pigeon community in Twickenham and just munching on my old mouldy old bread. Anyway, that's it for now. I'll see you in the next clip. Okay guys, I just got to work and it is proper freezing. I just cycle in and it's like minus two or something. Look, there's ice. And, uh, it's probably not that cold to be honest but it's just a bit of a shock to the system but I'm gonna get into work go and put a coffee on get myself nice and warm crack on do a bit of work and go Okay guys, so it's lunch time, well, that doesn't typically mean that we're going to have lunch because we're actually going to the gym at lunch time as we do every lunch time. I actually eat when I get back to my desk for the majority of the afternoon, but my boss doesn't seem to mind so it's all good. So I'm going with my gym partner, part time gym partner Alessandro, he doesn't train legs so we only train three times a week. So we're going to hit chest, back, got a noisy truck over there. So. See ya in the gym. Oh yeah, I'm gonna check in my weight as well at the gym, alright? So I'll see you in a bit. 
Okay, guys, so it turns out I didn't have shoes on. Now, this will all make sense at the end of the video. So just remember that. Anyway, starting off, my first set is my heaviest set. Now, this is <coughs> this is 75 kilograms. I'm not sure how many pounds that is. But Muscle Genes advised, because of my high ratio of slow twitch muscle fibers, that I should start off, after I've done my warm-ups, done two warm-ups, with a heavy set. So this is the heaviest set that I'm going to do. I've got three cleanish reps. Fourth one with a bit of help. 75 kilograms. Now, the next set is where I introduce the drop sets. So I'm starting off at 70 kilograms. So I get as many reps as that I can out on that, and then I drop it down by five. So we're on 60 kilograms now. Now, muscle genes said as well because I want to build muscle, and my genotype responds better to high volume and high frequency. They suggested training each muscle group twice a week and they also suggested using techniques such as drop sets to increase the training volume during my sessions. So that's what I'm doing here. We drop back that we drop down again, another five kilograms. So we're actually on twenty forty fifty kilograms on this set. So after this, I'm going to drop it down again by another 5 kilograms, and then that will complete uh, this main set, or this set. I'm going to do, after this, I will do another set exactly like this, but I don't think I got as many reps out. So anyway, that's this set done. Now the next set, or the final set after I've repeated this set, sorry, um, what I'll do is I'll put the same amount of weight on that I had on for my heavy set, but I'm going to use a slingshot just so I can get a bit more volume in. So it's really interesting because as you can see, you know, I can rep out a lot more reps cleaner using the slingshot. I know it's like assistance, but you know, it really helps get the volume in. You know, for those, uh, you know, for the training sessions. Anyway, that's it. I'll see you in a bit. Okay, guys, we're back in the kitchen. I'm back from work. Good gym session. You just seen it. Uh, you seen the scales. It's slightly confusing because I am up on what I was on Friday, but I got the camera in my hand and I think I forgot to take my shoes off. So I need to get some proper scales in the morning, basically. So I've just got in. I've had some Sultana brand through fibre. I know it's not full of eating, but I'm just telling you. Tonight we're going to have lamb shanks in mint gravy. And it's going to be awesome. I'm trying to eat about 3,200 calories. Uh, that's what I'm eating in a day. I was eating around 2004, 2002. So I bumped it up like another 1,000 calories past maintenance to just over maintenance by a couple of hundred calories so we're going to take it <clears throat> week by week month by month I don't want to get fat I'm trying to do a lean bulk because I don't want to get fat all right I'm not super lean at the minute as you can see still see my abs I don't know if you can see my serratus um, back So we'll take it week by week. I'll do progress update, weight, and uh, maybe show you my beautiful body again. Um, but that's it. That's my day. I'm going to finish off with some Pop-Tarts probably. Get some extra calories in. And I'll see you in the next video. If you've got any comments, questions, stick it in the box. If you like the video, thumbs up. Big up to everybody that's watching. And I'll see you in the next video.